Hey guys, welcome back to my channel for another cooking video. You guys requested more cooking videos and I'm trying to deliver. So today this is my version of honey garlic chicken. Probably not the traditional way of doing it, but it's how I do it. And it turned out pretty good. So here I am with the footage. I started out with boneless, skinless chicken thighs that I cleaned and washed. And then I started by seasoning it with my dry seasoning first. And my dry seasoning consisted of salt, black pepper, onion powder, a little adobo, chili flakes, and about a teaspoon of cornstarch. I don't like to add too much cornstarch because I just don't like the texture to get too gummy. So just about a teaspoon, if that was all I added. I mixed my dry seasoning up really, really well. And then I went in with my wet seasoning, which consisted of... Um, minced garlic, ginger paste, soya sauce, and honey. Um, I don't like my honey garlic chicken overly sweet, so I didn't add too much, but you can definitely add more if you, just depending on the level of sweetness that you like. Um, so yeah, so I mixed that up really, really well, covered it with some foil wrap, and let that sit in the fridge overnight. All right, so here I am the next day, and we had a lot of veggies in the fridge which is typically what happens when myself and half go grocery shopping separately without consulting each other first. So <laughs> had a lot of excess vegetables. I wanted to try and incorporate as much as I could into this dish. So right now I'm just chopping up some red bell peppers, some carrots, and some scallion. I set my carrots and bell peppers to the side, and now that all the prep's done, it's finally time to start cooking. So I'm starting with some chopped onions and minced garlic in a hot pan with oil and I let that cook down a bit and then add all my marinated chicken to the pot. So I let that cook down, stirring occasionally to avoid it sticking until the chicken is pretty much almost cooked all the way through and that's when I go ahead and add my veggies. I added my bell peppers, my carrots, my scallions and then I let it finish cooking all the way through right along with the vegetables. I made a quick cauliflower rice on the side to serve with it and that's it. Tastes really good. It does take way more time to prep this dish than cook it, but other than that, it's super quick and super tasty. Thanks for watching.